First thing you do is you put a pole in the ground and then you would draw a circle around it. In the old days, they would use a knotted rope or a chain with links and you could determine the length of the chain by the number of links. A lot of the chains that came from Europe, the links were carefully manufactured to be 0.792 degrees, which is interesting because then you get certain numbers like 7,920 inches. That gives you interesting geometric correlations. But Like what? Correlations like one of the ancient units of measurement is a furlong. The only place that I know that a furlong is still used today is in horse racing. It's one eighth of a mile, 660 feet. Well, if you translate that into inches, it's 7,920 inches. The diameter of the earth varies by 26 miles. The equator is 26 miles longer than the polar diameter. It goes from equator 7,926 miles, pole 7,900. 26 miles different diameter. But if you took a perfectly spherical earth, the diameter of that perfectly spherical earth that had the same surface area as the actual earth, it'd be 7,920 miles. Same number of miles as there is inches in a furlong. That inch to this furlong is the same ratio as one mile is to the diameter of the earth. But that number shows up in a bunch of other interesting places as well. 